Peyote. Peyote spells out P O T pot. Yeah. And that's peyote and it's in a pot. That's illegal? Mega. Well, it's a plant. Yeah, you gotta be Indian. Oh. Do you got a little in you? Huh? You got a little in you? No, a shaman gave it to me actually when I was like sixteen. Oh, that's like a round that's like a bypass. Yeah. Okay. What up friends? What up family? We're out here in San Bernardino. That's the type of shit you want to fly your drone through. Yeah. So you want to go inspect it? Uh, is it easy? I don't know. We're urban exploring. <laughs> Looks pretty easy. Like I was like excited to see Sean and some Sean's dude that guy was like happy to see you I know, right? he was like wow I, was say, I could take you by like the tent city but nah fuck a tent city bro right, let's go let's go by this oh, I'm out here with Sean Sean is my boss some days Sean hooks me up with uh, blue collar jobs and we put up signs. Sean has a company called Signs on the Fly. He'll print you a sign and he'll put it up for you. He'll drive all the way to Arizona, fly all the way to Atlanta. We got my Suron up and running. My, uh, Lug shook off. My axle lug shook off. Felt all wobbly. And I kept riding. I kept riding and I because I was having such a fun adventure. Uh, and it eventually shook off, which obviously it was going to shake off. And it's not an easy lug nut to find. It's an M12 fine threaded uh, nut. Very difficult to find. But Sean hooked me up with the spare parts. Signs on the fly? Huh? Signs on the fly? Print. Print on the fly. I was saying that you're my boss sometimes. Like this, grip, grip, 
and then and then and then so like grip when you go up and then you and then put your legs out. Jeez, bro. You gotta be better with that. Oh, yeah. Everybody out here, I told you. you yeah. Get something to drink before we go up there? Nah. Nah, you're good? Nah, yeah. You gotta be better with braking, man. Why? Well, just don't stop so hard. Oh, sorry. You don't have brake lights. My bad. If Sean tries to tell me how to do a wheelie again, I'm going to tell him how to use his brakes. That's a perfect example of a power wheelie. Solid power wheelie. Like a real wheelie or like a power wheelie? No, like a real slow wheelie doing the turns and everything. Oh, nice. Oh, I thought there was people up there. It's just statues. I thought those were security guards. Yeah. They're very welcoming um, <laughs> astronomers. Wow, that's creepy looking. She's Indian. Well, that's, I wasn't saying that because of that. Native American. <laughs> Here, let me turn mine just a little bit more. Move it inward like this. Inward? Yeah, like closer to his feet. Yeah, there you go, right there. Stop. Yep, right there. And I'll turn my bars. Let's ride. My battery cap wasn't on the whole time. It was, it was loose. My rear linkage has a factory default in it, according to Sean. Suron owners, check the little triangle piece that's in your rear linkage and see if there's little teeny holes in it where the screws come out. Oh, I never noticed it, but Sean seems to think it's an issue and it could snap on me when I hit a bit of big jump. I don't think it would kill me, but I don't want to get stranded. Where are you taking me? They blocked my trail. Well, luckily we have Surons. Mm. Mm. Turn around. Turn around? No, go through right there. Yeah, I would just go right through this bush right here. Yeah. If this if someone didn't bring their freaking bed up here to dispose of it. Right oh. Oh, that's the way to go? I already committed to this way. That works. Why is there a Dippin' Dots machine out here? I don't understand why people bring their crap out here.
Oh, free sun hat. People, humans in general, don't know how to dispose of shit. Oh, I fucking hate these bushes. Oh my god, oh. Whoa, oh god, oh god, oh god. That was terrifying. <laughs> Those bushes fucked me up. Yeah, I couldn't. Oh, no, huh? Uh, minor scratch. Super steep, right? Yeah. yeah was. Got squirrely at the end. <laughs> that was a lot of faith. A lot of faith in that bridge. This is like one of them things where like you go down it and then all of a sudden there's just like some guy from Jackass cruising down on like a uh, like a shopping cart or something. We were just um, underneath the bridge. I'm underneath the bridge a lot of the time, I've realized. I think the movie The Batman just made me realize it. If you go back there, there's trails that go all the way back up there, and then there's a wash back there by that water reservoir. I just want to hit a couple senders. Let's go. Me and Sean and Eric are about to head out to Arizona. Not with the bus. Not taking the bus. We're taking Nissan Frontier and three Surrounds. There's a guy, yeah. Uh, what's it called? Hang gliding. There's a hang gliding place right over here. Uh, yes! Oh my god, this is what I've been waiting for. This is what you need a surround for. Oh! 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 Yo, look at this fucking sender. Oh my god. Dude, fun, huh? dude, this is incredible. Right? Why didn't you want to come here? I did. Oh. Is there a are we going the wrong way? Like is there a certain like a starting line and shit? I would love to fully upgrade my Suron, put all this all this unnecessary shit on there. And just make it all ass and just troll on the uh, Mercedes Benz and shit in traffic, but I would still enjoy my stock Suron a lot. And I always say they can't break. And we've seen that they can. 
if you beat on them hard enough, you will shake your rear axle loose. These are fun, these are fun. Really gonna hurt in the morning though. I feel like I got to hit that. That was a big sender, that one. Dude, look at this. Huh? That's a sender. That eats the water. I mean, just, I'm not going to hit it. I'm just going to take a look at it. Huh? <laughs> I sort of cased it. I sort of cased it, but I went balls out. Actually, no, not really because we reconned it. Balls out would be just hitting it without even looking. I cased it a little bit. Yeah, that was still good. You barely caught it on the back end, but dude, it was still good. It looked good. It felt good. Okay. Not that we're racing. But mine is 72. No, it's dangerous. His is 72, mine is 60. There's some real debris in those rocks. We gotta take Sean out to um, Lake uh, Elsinore. That's where the real ripping goes down. I know what it means to be stoked now, I get it. I'm hella stoked right now. Oh, hey ladies. Dang, they walked far. Fuck, walking, unless it's on a treadmill indoors. With Netflix on. I think the reason my uh, wheelies were so shit was because my rear wheel was just not on there good at all it's something that is, I should have checked you know as a Suron uh, enthusiast it's something I should have definitely been keeping an eye on see we got to see look at that shit got to stay away from him he does crazy shit like that we're going half fast as hell and he'll just slam on the brakes Look, you're going immediately out with your leg Right? Oh, no, yeah, I know. You're going with it, try to go like this. Just think of hugging this. Okay. Until you get it up. Hug it, and then you get it up. And then if you need to, use these to, to adjust your weight. Okay. But when you're going up, this will give you a stable, like, pull-up, like, because you're gripping it with your hip. I wish I had, the, like, if I had the power that you have, I could totally do wheelies. <laughs> or, you know, power wheelies. And when you're, uh, when you're going fast as hell. You're in the grass. It's not gonna get fucked up. Go. No, I'm good. Try it out. Are we in full power mode? Yes, sir. Man, the 
thing's nice. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> like if I had the power that you have, I could totally do wheelies. Oh my god, bro! Right, yeah, look, look. Oh my god! The difference, look. The difference oh my god, mine. I hurt my nutsack a little bit. You right? Yeah. Look, the difference between yours and mine, you don't. It's about 12 volts. <laughs> it's a lot, the power wise, right? So, Dude, I think I fucked your beer up. Ah, oh, bro. Just your, just your pride, bro. That's it. Look, <laughs> so listen to me. So, look. Dude, that's why I didn't want to ride it. You don't it. need to pump on my bike. And now I know. You don't need to go like that because you're already, and you're, if you're throttling, bro, the throttle will lift you. Wow. I've been spending so much time trying stock sir on wheelies. This is too sensitive. Insane. I'd have to relearn everything. But this is wild. I mean, I've ridden a 72 volt Suron before, obviously, but man. Heavy as fuck, though. This thing's fun as hell, dude. You may need to slow down to get it to pull you up. Like you're used to slowing down to trying to get it to go up. Yeah, I know, but I'm trying to learn like wheelies, not not power wheelies. Power wheelies are scary. Bro, your bike is like feels impossible to pull up. I know, dude. But I've learned on I've learned on it, so I can't really do it on someone else's. Yeah, they're gonna be slow on that for sure. Well, I'd rather learn learn them slower. I got so much grass up my ass. I really should not have tried that so soon. Wow, look at this bitch bike now. No, I like it. I like it how it is for now. Thank you though. What are we doing, man? Why are you riding like that? Huh? Why are you riding like that? Like what? Just lead the way and go and... Oh, I was telling you to move over because the truck was like doing stupid shit behind you. Okay. Well... <sighs> That's it for the vlog, guys. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for supporting the culture. Thanks for clicking the like button. Consider subscribing to my Patreon. We get up-to-date vlogs ad-free. Save a dinosaur, ride an e-bike. Next two next vlog is gonna be in Arizona. Peace.